Okay, guys. Okay, guys. I am back. It has been months since I have done a video. This feels really, really good to get back on this. I think it's been like, I don't know, four to five months since I've done um, uh, another YouTube video. It's been a while. Um, it, it, it's been a while, guys. If you guys are wondering why it's been so long, it's it was because I, I thought that I got my channel hacked. But then I realized that I accidentally like, like got signed out and, but my mom just fixed it for me. Um, I feel really stupid because this entire time I could have been posting, but I thought I got hacked and I just couldn't figure it out. But we finally figured it out. It took a while, but we got it. Um, I think the last video that I did was, um, like, I think the last video I did guys was my mini bike engine blew up that was a while ago it's weird thinking back that far but yeah so here's my engine um it's not really like super new now I've, I've had it for i've had it on here for a good couple months two maybe three months now but this is the predator 212 that's the engine that blew up but anyway here's the predator 212 guys um i'm running the straight chain a while ago, like, I'm just gonna have to get you guys caught up just because I've been doing a lot ever since you guys, ever since I've done a video, a lot of things have changed. A while ago, I took the jack shaft off and I have the straight chain running, but I'm gonna put the jack shaft on here pretty soon just because the straight chain makes the bike go a lot faster. But like overall, overall this thing goes like close to 50, but the accelerations are really, really slow. I have the pipe on there right now. Everything's stock other than the pipe. Um, I haven't messed with the governor or anything because the last time I did that, as you guys know, on my other engine, that's how I blew it up, I think, is because I messed with the governor. So now I know not to do that. I'm definitely not going to do that. Um, yeah, this is the Predator 212, guys. It's a pretty nice engine. I've had it on here for a couple months now. Um, definitely pretty nice. Brand new. Just got it off Amazon. Um, so yeah, guys, I mean, it, it's, a, it's definitely a nice engine. I've been... You know, making sure I do good maintenance on it and stuff. So I'm taking pretty good care of it. So yeah, that guys, that's nothing really new with the mini bike. I'm, you know, I'm soon, I'm soon, I'm going to be trying to save up for a, uh, for a dirt bike. Cause my uncle is selling his, I'm my uncle is selling his for 2,200. It's, it's a pretty old bike, but I mean, it's in, it's in pretty good shape. He's, t it's a 2001. Um, I forgot the brand, but it's it's pretty old but i mean the engine's in pretty good shape it just needs new tire it it just needs new tires and a new chain but other than that it's, it's in pretty decent shape at least i think or at least that's what he told me so that's for the mini bike but the main thing guys that i want to let you know on my personal life is i got a job i i got a job at discount tire um did I say that right? Discount tire, tire discount. Yeah, wh whatever. But discount tire, I got a tire. I, I got a job at, um, which is very, very amazing. Um, it's. Uh, I just started like a little over a month ago. I got done with the computer training, and I've only been doing. I've only been doing the actual training here for maybe like two to three weeks, and I'm already doing really good. Like I can change and repair a tire and do the entire process like by myself now, and so I'm. And I'm doing pretty good. I work Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Saturday from 1 p.m. to 6 p.m. Because that's when they close at 6. And um, so, yeah, I guess, I mean, I'm doing great with the job. Um, right now, I think I'm making like $14 an hour, $15 an hour. But soon I can move up. Like once I get, you know, pretty good at it. <sighs> soon I can move up and make more money. But, hey, yeah, guys, I mean, the job's doing really good. Like I'm doing really good. Um, so yeah, that's in terms of the job. And then, um, other than that, I mean, no, nothing really too dramatic has changed. I'd say me working is definitely the main thing. Um, and, and, and like, don't worry guys, me working is not going to stop me from making, from making videos. I'm probably, probably still going to post probably at least two times a week, three times a week. So work is not going to affect, like, I'm not going to let me working affect me posting at all. Um, and I'm sorry for going this many months without doing a video, guys. I'm, I that was my fault. But here's the new, here's the new engine, guys. Um, it's a it's a really nice engine. I'm gonna set my phone down right now and put some gas in it and start it up for you guys. Um, and I do have the upgraded carb on there just so it doesn't run lean because with the pipe, 
you need the um with the pipe you need the up the upgraded carb so I'm, I set, I'm gonna set the phone down i'm gonna put some gas in it right now guys and start it up i hope you guys can hear it good you guys should be able to so just gonna put a little bit of gas in there not a lot just a little bit just so you guys can hear it Spilling gas. Oh, crap. That's not good. Oh, All right. This is not a very good funnel I have right now, guys. That's enough, guys. Put the cat back on. See you, guys. Alright guys, I'm gonna start this thing up. Hold on, let me make sure I have a good angle on this thing. Yeah, you guys should be able to see it pretty good. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna start it up for you guys. I hope you guys can hear it pretty good. But I'm gonna start it up, let it run for a few seconds, and then, yeah. By the way guys, this engine is a lot better in my opinion than the other one. Like, I've had like... Maybe like, like I have really haven't had many problems with this engine. This Predator engine, in my opinion, is a lot better than the other engine because the other engine guys like just had a lot of problems. Stuff would break quicker. This 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 engine is a lot more reliable. So. Here it is. The pipe's super loud. So, sounds pretty good. I'll rev it up for you guys. Hey guys that is how it sounds um so it sounds pretty good guys um that's in terms of the mini bike um so yeah um it's doing pretty good but yeah guys i mean in terms of like my personal life really um really not much has um has changed um, I mean, the, I, I'd say me working at Discount Tire is definitely, like, the biggest difference. For me, at least, because, like, I don't know. Like, it, like it just feels good to be making money and stuff. Um, it, I, pro I will probably have that 250, my uncle's 250, here pretty soon. I'll probably have it here pretty soon. I don't know how soon, but most likely I'll have it here maybe in the next, like, 
few months, maybe another five, six months, I'll have it because. So yeah, guys, um, that's pretty much the video, guys. I don't really know what else to really talk about. There's not really much else going on right now. Um, I definitely haven't been riding this mini bike as much. I've kind of, I've kind of grown out of it a little bit. Like I still enjoy riding it, but not as much as I used to. I probably ride it like once a week now, maybe twice a week. Um, I used to ride this thing like every single day, but I don't know. I just, I don't really enjoy it as much as I used to. I don't know. I mean, it's, it's still a nice bike, but I don't know. So you guys, that is the video guys. I am so freaking happy to be back. It feels good to be making videos again. Um, and this is just one of many. I, I'm once, once this video gets uploaded, I'm going to be making tons of other videos and stuff like that. Um, another thing for the mini bike guys soon, I might be installing a torque converter on this thing. Um, honestly probably here in the next like couple weeks or a month maybe depending on what i decide to do with the straight chain and the jack shaft but i just heard the the torque converter is like way better like it's just way more reliable because then i don't got to worry about me having to replace the clutch or the chain because it's just a drive system like i don't really know much to like i don't really know that much about it guys all i know is is that it's just super reliable and like it's just a much more smoother ride, a lot more reliable than having a chain or two chains. Let me know what, let me know in the comments what you guys think about the torque converter and if you guys know more about it than I do and if you guys think I should get it. That is the video, guys. I am so freaking happy to be back. And as always, subscribe, share, like, comment, boom.